Hi everyone, it's Ashley and today I'm going to show you the August Coco Daisy kit called 80 Days. Okay, so 80 Days is sort of a travel themed kit, but if you're a bit of a homebody like I am, it certainly is versatile enough to um, scrap everyday moments or maybe just like little day trips or I think it would be good for outdoorsy kind of photos too. Okay, so this features um, quite a bit of paper from the new line from Basic Grey called Cart Postal. It's a great line. It's very cool. It has a lovely grid pattern and this sort of cool subway map. Find Your Wings and Fly from My Mind's Eye. Multicolored chevron. And I love this side with this um, lovely pale mustard and white um, sort of fishtail scallop. Also from Cart Postal from Basic Gray, some um, travel tickets and this really awesome sort of starburst pattern in gray and white on this side that I really love. I like both of these sides again. I'm going to be torn over which side to use as I often am. From the Fancy Pants Memories Captured line, a lovely sort of pale salmon-y red color with this diamond pattern. And some little cut apart cards with this popular chalkboard style look and then some little Polaroid um, cards. From Travel Girl from October Afternoon, a lovely black and white map. Um, I love map paper, so I'm excited to see what there are some of them. And this kit, gray and white chevron, always a good choice. From Basic Gray again, lovely globes. I love that this is sort of distressed and vintage, but has this very modern, clean kind of look with the way it's laid out on the gray background. And then some little circles with numbers and less alphanumeric kind of pattern in it. That will be a lot of fun, I think. And then a basic gray alphabet with three different ones, circles, little tiny tiles, and then die cut letters, and a couple of cute little stickers on it. So that's pretty versatile, and I like the colors. And then cardstock this month include this lovely pale blue, a nice flat, um, kind of like manila kind of style. A pale, pale blue or gray. I'm sure someone would be willing to argue with me about what color that actually is. And then um, dark, 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 dark gray that's almost black, but not actually totally true black. So lots of nice neutrals there. Okay, and then for the little tree bits that always come packaged in lovely bags that are fun to open, it's like a little gift. Um, first of all, sequins. Very exciting. They're popular and a lot of fun, and kind of a nice alternative to confetti or um, glitter. And these are a lovely mix of pretty pale pink and pale yellow kind of colors. They kind of remind me of sunsets and really good drinks when you're out on holiday. A cool vintage um, airline travel tag. Okay, and I am totally going to save this bag with the washi tape on it to use in something. So right now I'm calling this and saying I am going to use this. I will repurpose this bag. Alright, so let's see what's in here. I haven't actually opened this up yet, so this is a surprise both for me and you. Oh, cute, cute, cute. Under. Camera. Can you see them? They're so light. Camera and paper clips. Cool cream wired, which is kind of handy because it makes really nice um, bows or you can fold it nicely and it keeps its shape. Ribbon with sort of a horizontal chevron woven into it. It's a woven ribbon, which is nice. Washi tape, gray stripe, very cool. This is always a nice thing to have, a whole entire roll. Nice. Okay. Ooh, a very lovely wood veneer tag. With a little eyelet set in the top, very delicate and pretty. Some little malt liquor labels. Cool. Some little vocabulary cards, which are nice. Nice to have, a nice little bit of ephemera. And of course our lovely Coco Daisy 
packaging card. Okay, so that was what was in one of the kits, one of the little boxes. And then, also in the main kit is a whole entire package of um, die cuts from the basic gray cart post outline. So we'll just sort of look at them really quickly so you can get an idea of what's in there. There's all sorts of frames and tags and banners, just like little airmail kind of sign, luggage, cute little green airplane, discover label, nice travel -y chevrons, a acetate tag to match the um, pattern paper, a map of the USA, excellent for Americans or people who travel to America, a clock, a compass, cute glasses because those are trendy and fun, all sorts of little great bits and pieces, nice little um, stamp, <laughs> suitcase, and then I think the rest of these are going to be, we'll take mostly cardboard, little tickets that say who, where, when, what, little journaling tag, today, a little bit of ephemera, more frames, more postcards, more journaling spots. Ooh, a very nice vintage. You can see it because it's a transparency vintage map. It's pretty cool. And a film strip. So fun, fun, fun stuff this month from 80 Days to Main Kit from Coco Daisy for the month of August. Okay, so next up is the August Day in the Life kit from Coco Daisy. I don't actually do Day in the Life, Project Life style scrapbooking, but I love this kit so much, so I just had to have it. So there's a nice set of Jenny Bowen alphabets. I've actually already used several sheets of, this, sheets of these stickers in other projects, and I really love them, so they're very versatile. They're a great size. Oh, there's Huffy Puffy Kitten. Come on, no video for you. Okay. Just sit there, sit there, stay out of the way. And then, a whole bunch of really awesome cards. Look at that airplane going around the world. How awesome is that? Travel log, road trip, do these pretty airplanes, little camera, travel musings. I love this one, point A to point B. C, an en route card cute little labels. I mean, this would be awesome to use as is, or you could cut them apart. And a great map. Very awesome. Package of basic gray silver studs, which I really am excited about. I like these very much. This is actually a whole entire package of labels. So they're individual sheets. There is labels and arrows and circles and pointy arrows and arrows in circles and line labels, and plain labels, and small labels, and speech bubble labels, and fold over tabs that you could fold over or not fold over, and then little journaling labels that look like um, tickets, which are very awesome. They're going to be great for um, labeling things. Okay, and then in the little baggie of goodness, we will see what's in here. I also have not opened this up, so once again, surprise for me and you. Okay. Very cute. There's wood veneer airplanes and suitcases. Lots of great different airplane shapes for all your different airplane travels. Some more suitcases. And um, Baker's Twine in a nice sort of camel brown color. So there is... The Day in the Life kit for the month of August from Coco Daisy. Lovely stuff. Okay, so the paper in add-on kit number one includes sheet from Basic Gray Cart Post Style, and this is awesome. It is just covered in little faux um, postage stamp kind of images that have little sort of black perforation mark style around each one, and I collect postage stamps, so I just go crazy for anything that has any kind of postage stamp on it. So I probably would have bought this kit just based on this paper alone, even without all the other awesome stuff that's in the kit. The back side is a nice diagonal um, 
mini gray and white chevron. And then the other paper is this cool grid pattern that's actually um, red and green with little polka dots in between and a nice multi-diagonal chevron. So those are quite nice. And then the letter stickers and add-on one are burlap stickers. Um, they're very cool. They're die cut burlap and they're awesome. And I'm actually thinking these would look great on their own, but also I might whitewash them with a little bit of gesso. Thinking about that still. I'll have to test with some letters I don't use, like the letter X or something like that. Okay, and then there's a nice neutral pack of um, flair from Evolicious. They're all travel themed. Well, not really travel themed, that's true. Um, so if they look here, one of them does say vacation. Right here, here's the details, place, love this. So you can certainly use them for a more everyday kind of themed stuff. And then from the Travel Girl line, there's a package of tidbits from October Afternoon, which are just lovely little die cut tabs and labels circles, little pointer things. So these are great for just adding in little details and layering. And they're actually all double-sided, which is really nice. So you could use them plain if you're not into the things that say things. From Fancy Pants, from the Memories Captured line, a package of little paper baggies that are very sweet and are in great colors and patterns. I just just adore them. Um, so that's really nice. And then from Basic Gray Cart Post Style there is a whole package of wood veneers. So this is actually, there's lots of them in here. There's frames, words, uh, a very cool speech bubble. More words. Banners and cars and planes. And I totally think there should be a train, but I don't think there is because who travels by train anymore? Little labels and ampersand. More cool speech bubbles. Of course, geotags. All sorts of chevrons. Um, these cool, um, like, uh, diploma seal kind of shapes with numbers die cut out of them and then you get the numbers too. Little arrows and all sorts of awesome stuff. So there is add-on kit number one. All right now add-on kit number two. All right so this matte paper from Basic Gray Cart Post Style that's in add-on number two is just seriously really awesome and I think that I sort of love it the back side is pretty cool too it has a wavy green pattern on cream but this side is just awesome and I just want to hang it up so pretty okay travel girl word stickers okay and then from the awesome. aqua style line from basic gray or maybe the capture line I don't know anyways they're from basic gray um letter stickers little teeny tiny little letter stickers and I admit I thought there was just one sheet and I was kind of excited about that but check this out check this out look at this orange black seafoam green red brown royal blue six sheets of letter stickers that have uppers and lowers and they're maybe like three quarters of a centimeter tall really really awesome I mean, you don't have to handwrite or type any journaling this month. You could buy add-on kit number two and do all your journaling for the entire month in letter stickers. How fun would that be? From Freckled Fawn. Fawn. Let me try that again. From Freckled Fawn. Ombre enamel dots. These remind me of a sunset and make me want to go to a beach and drink really good tasty things. Now this may be one of my favorite things this month. I've never seen these button packs in person from Fancy Pants. And this is seriously totally awesome. This is a fantastic mix of little chipboard pieces, like plastic buttons, wooden buttons, chipboard buttons, little stars, 
I mean, this is just, oh, look at that cute little mint green little tiny star button. This is practically perfect, and I kind of just want to use the whole thing just as is, practically on the layout, just like plop the whole thing down. Um, so I really like these, and I'm excited. I'm just excited by them. Okay, and from Carte Postel from Basic Grey, a lovely set of flair. These have a fabulous vintage kind of style to them. Um, there's a map and a little airplane globe trotter. This is Adventures here. Let's go, a cute little camera. This little um, airmail kind of insignia looking thing. So here is fabulous add on number two. All right, and now for the pattern paper add on. It starts out with lovely constellation pattern vellum from Studio Calico, from the Atlantic line. This is a beautiful sheet of vellum, and you probably will want to keep it, but you should just use it because it's really awesome. And then, from Webster's Pages, from a line by Allison Kraft, a, well, it's so hard to see with the glare, airplane transparency. And his airplane's kind of laid out in like a crisscross grid kind of pattern, kind of vintage retro looking airplanes. Totally cool. And when I saw these together in the kit, I was totally excited to try to find a way to use them together. So I'm going to see what I'm going to come up with um, this month for my projects. Okay, again from Basic Grey Cart Postal, little um, airline tags and a lovely mint green pattern on the back side. From October Afternoon's Travel Girl line, mint green and um, orange. It's kind of looks like a diamond pattern, but it's actually little blobby kind of waves. And then um, pale blue and gray arrows that say one way. Cameras, always fun and cool, no matter what you're scrapbooking. And stripes, another wonderful map. I mean, I really love maps, so this is a really super exciting kit for me this month. And then a sort of a different sort of mint chevron kind of pattern. Anchors, because everyone loves anchors right now on navy blue, nice and crisp and white. And then this really cute little wave pattern on blue with some little sailboats in it, which would be really cute. I mean, if you don't go sailing or something, wouldn't this not be adorable for bathtub pictures? I mean, everyone's got pictures of their cute little chubby little babies in the bathtub. So um, I'm thinking that's what I might use this one for. Nice buttery yellow from Fancy Pants, that diamond pattern, again, and then this cool, this would make an awesome title page, I think, if you make title pages for your albums, because it's just asking for something laid out there. Polka dots, colored sherbety polka dots, also from Fancy Pants, and then this lovely salmon colored um, chevron color is pretty for summertime and a lovely wood green I really love wood greens I love that they make them in all these cool colors right now also from fancy pants and then the back side is this very cool well you can just see that it's very cool you can see that for yourself all right so thanks so much for taking kit tour with me this month and have fun happy scrapbooking bye